Hi, I'm Morgan Vanek. I'm a PhD candidate in the English department, and I wanted to tell you a bit about reading reflections. So I developed this as an activity to help students feel prepared to participate in every class. I also hope that they're a good opportunity to practice what I think is the most important critical skill that students learn in their English classes, close reading. When I teach close reading, uh, I walk students through a series of three questions in just about every class. So when we're confronting a new text, I first ask students to tell me what is literally going on here. And then I ask them what's figuratively going on here, what's interesting about the way that this story is told. And then we spend most of the class talking about the relationship between those two observations. Why tell this story this way? So the reading reflection is meant to help them work through that process on their own before class with each reading that we do. They have to fill out a cue card that includes answers to those three questions. On the back, uh, I ask them to take a bit more space to think about the relationship between the observations they've made. Often I ask them to phrase that as a question for further discussion in class. Then when they come to class, everyone's got their cue card, and then we, we work through those questions as a group. We start with, how did you answer each of these questions? And then we spend most of our time talking through uh, their questions about the possible relationships between the subjects they identified and the formal features that they found interesting. My favorite thing about the reading reflections uh, is that also they, they keep students on track throughout the term. There are always students who come up to me at the final exam and, and admit that they found the reading reflections really helpful. They were really glad to have them, both because they reminded them about what they had read, but they had their own opinion. They already had a close reading sort of in the works um, that they could then leverage on the final exam. So um, that's always rewarding. <laughs>